The cabinet secretary IAST, Mamtramandala Sachiva is the top most executive official and senior most civil servant of the Government of India. The cabinet secretary is the ex officio head of the Civil Services Board, the cabinet secretariat, the Indian Administrative Service IAS, and all civil services under the rules of business of the government. The cabinet secretary is the senior most cadre post of the Indian Administrative Service, ranking 11th on the Indian Order of Precedence. The Cabinet Secretary is under the direct charge of the Prime Minister. In 2010, the Cabinet Secretary's term length was extended to a maximum of four years, giving the then incumbent an additional year in office. History Origin <inaudible> 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 The precursor to the cabinet, the Executive Council of the Viceroy, used to have a secretariat, which was headed by the private secretary of the Viceroy. At first, the role of this secretariat was merely to take care of the paperwork related to the Executive Council but when the work of the individual departments under the council increased, the work of the secretariat too became more complex. The private secretary came to be known as the secretary of the secretariat. And this post became more powerful over time as the Secretariat's main role became coordinating the work of the departments. In 1946, the Secretariat became Cabinet Secretariat and the Secretary became the Cabinet Secretary. After independence in 1947, the functions of the Secretariat underwent major changes. A series of committees on economic, defense and intelligence matters was constituted under the Cabinet Secretariat. Most of the departments created after independence functioned under the cabinet secretariat and were later seconded to the respective ministries. The position holder is accountable for ensuring that the civil service is equipped with the skills and capability to meet the everyday challenges it faces and that the civil servants work in a fair and decent environment. For nearly 25 years after the independence of India, the post of the cabinet secretary was occupied by members of the erstwhile Indian Civil Service ICS. All members of ICS were young since the upper age limit for joining was 24 years. The retirement age in the Government of India before 1962 was 55 years. Therefore, the ICS officers would become cabinet secretaries after about 32 years of service. When the retirement age increased to 58 years in 1962, the cabinet secretaries had about 34 to 35 years experience before they occupied that post. With further increase in retirement age to 60 years in 1998, cabinet secretaries have generally served for 37 to 38 years before their appointment. Topic: <laughs> Functions and power. Topic: The following are the functions of the cabinet secretary. Heads the cabinet secretariat. Acts as the chief coordinator of the central government. Acts as the chairman of the Civil Services Board, which among other things, recommends impanelment of officers, for the ranks of secretary, additional secretary and joint secretary. Act as the chairman of the Committee of Secretaries on Administration. Act as the chairman of the Conference of Chief Secretaries of States. Recommends postings of officers of the rank of secretary and additional secretary to the Appointments Committee of the Cabinet ACC. Acts as the Chairman of Senior Selection Board, which recommends postings of officers of the rank of Joint Secretary in the Union Government to the Appointments Committee of the Cabinet ACC. Acts as a Senior Advisor to the Prime Minister. Provide assistance to the Council of Ministers. Prepares the agenda of the Cabinet and minutes its meetings. Provide an element of continuity and stability to administration during crises. Topic role topic In the Government of India Allocation of Business Rules, 1961, the Cabinet Secretariat finds a place in the first schedule to the rules. The subjects allotted to this secretariat are, firstly, secretarial assistance to Cabinet and Cabinet Committees, and secondly, the administration of the rules of business. The Cabinet Secretariat is responsible for the administration of the Transaction of Business Rules, 1961 and the Allocation of Business Rules, 1961 of the Government of India, facilitating smooth transaction of business in ministries, departments of the government by ensuring adherence to these rules. 
The Secretariat assists in decision making in government by ensuring interministerial coordination, ironing out differences amongst ministries, departments, and evolving consensus through the instrumentality of the standing, ad hoc committees of secretaries. Through this mechanism, new policy initiatives are also promoted. The Cabinet Secretariat ensures that the President of India, the Vice President and Ministers are kept informed of the major activities of all departments by means of a monthly summary of their activities. Management of major crisis situations in the country and coordinating activities of the various ministries in such a situation is also one of the functions of the Cabinet Secretariat. The Cabinet Secretariat comprises three wings, civil, military and intelligence. The civil wing is considered to be the main wing and provides aid, advice and assistance to the Union Cabinet. The purpose of having the military wing is to have better coordination in intelligence and to provide secretarial assistance to the Defense Committee of the Cabinet and the National Defense Council. The military wing is represented by an officer of the rank of Major General, or its equivalents in the Indian Armed Forces, who is designated as a Joint Secretary in the Cabinet Secretariat. The Intelligence Wing deals with matters pertaining to the Joint Intelligence Committee of the Union Cabinet. The Chief of the Research and Analysis Wing also officially first reports to the Cabinet Secretary, and is designated Secretary in the Cabinet Secretariat. The first Administrative Reforms Commission found that the average tenure of the Cabinet Secretary was two years and eight months, which was considered to be inadequate. It recommended a tenure of three to four years. It also wanted that cabinet secretary to act as the principal staff officer to the prime minister, the cabinet and the cabinet committees for important matters. Topic head of the All India Civil Service Topic As head of the civil services, the incumbent position holder is accountable for ensuring that the civil services are equipped with the skills and capability to meet the everyday challenges it faces and that civil servants work in a fair and decent environment. The Cabinet Secretary is arguably India's most powerful bureaucrat and the right hand of the Prime Minister of India. Topic emolument, accommodation and perquisites Topic The Cabinet Secretary to Government of India is eligible for a diplomatic passport. The official earmarked residence of the Cabinet Secretary is 32 Prithviraj Road, New Delhi, a Type 8 bungalow. The salary and emolument in this rank is equivalent to Chief of the Army Staff, and its equivalents in the Indian Armed Forces. Topic. List of Cabinet Secretaries of India after 1950 Topic. Topic. See also Topic. Defence Secretary India. Foreign Secretary India. Home Secretary India. Chief Secretary India. Topic. Notes Topic. Topic. References Topic. Topic. External links Topic. Cabinet Secretariat Government of India Official portal of the Indian Government Union Public Service Commission